Hello and welcome to the 49 tutorial in the SFML 2.1 series. In this part we're going to be showing you how to add text. We'll be using the source code from the third tutorial. If you don't have it, don't worry, there'll be a link in the description. Okay, we're going to cover how SFML handles the drawing of text. Unfortunately, SFML cannot access the fonts from your system. Hence, they need to be added manually like an image or audio file. So, let's just add our font to our project. I've got a TTF, font.ttf. You can get them online if you just go to dafont.com, da font.com. That's a really nice, cool website. Obviously, when you get the fonts, make sure you have permission to use this. A lot of time, if you need to pay for it, they'll say for personal use is fine, but for commercial use, you either have to pay or you're just not allowed. And now, what we can do is in our project to draw font, it's really simple. We just do ff font. Or draw text first of all, you need to load the font file. Then you do F. Very similar to how we've uh, done sprites and textures. So if you can get your head around that, you'll get your head around this. So you're going to do ampersand font dot load. Oh, forgot to set the name for the font. So font dot load from file. And then here I'm going to put Arial.ttf and obviously you can handle the error however you want. Maybe you want to put a C out, maybe you want to try and unload a different a font file, maybe you're just going to use sprites, or maybe you're going to close the application. There's loads of ways that you can do this. Next thing we're going to do is SF text. This is what you're actually going to be drawing and what you're going to visually see. I'm going to call it text. Then we're going to set some properties. First one is text.set font. That's probably one of the most important ones because obviously it needs a font. And now we're going to do text.setString because otherwise it doesn't say what we want it to say. And I'm going to make it say Batman because Batman's awesome. Ah, did not want to do that. And in the next property, we're going to say the color. And for this, it's just SF color red. Or is that down there? Should be up here. Then I'm going to do text.set character size. And bear in mind this is in pixels. So I'm going to put 40. And finally, we need to draw the text onto the windows so if we go down here. Window.draw. And then I'm just going to put the text. Run our application. We have our text drawn. We've got Batman drawn right there. No task for you to do, check out the other functionality provided by the text object. It has all the functionality that a sprite class does, like setting its position, rotating, scaling, experiment with it, and see what sort of cool stuff you can do. Maybe even look into making the uh, text flash, because obviously you can set the color. That is it for this tutorial. In the next part of this series, we're going to be looking at collision. If you have any questions, feel free to message us at support at sonosystems.co.uk. The email will be in the description. You can comment on this video or just directly message us via YouTube. All the required links for source code will also be in the description. And as usual, thank you for watching, and I hope you have a great day.